Okay, here we're running in the loop on the triple loop Cosmos 1000. Uh, as you can see, the reservoir is attached to the rail. There's a little clips made out of Lexan that uh, make the reservoir easy to remove, but it's also, as you can see, secure. And this is the best way to run in the reservoir if you if you just happen to have one of these, you know, in your house and you're wondering, gee, how do I fill the reservoir? Well, you rock it back and forth. Obviously, you cap off the reservoir before you rock it forward, but right now we're letting the air out so the caps are off. I'm using a jumper power supply, so you know, the rest of the rig is inert. So if there were a leak, it wouldn't be an issue. But, uh, Man, CyberDrew doesn't have any leaks in his liquid cooling systems. What are you guys thinking? I think I must be a chump. I have no fear. Got about a $3,000 rig here. We just put some water in it. Fire it up. Anyway, backside is not very pretty. Luckily, we don't have a window to look at all that lovely wiring. But all the pumps are running. So you can tell it's pretty quiet. This is what's making all the noise. It's cheap ass power supply. The pumps themselves are dead silent, transmitting no sound to the case. I put the camera right on top of the case. You're not going to hear any sound coming from the pumps. Pretty excited about getting this rig fired up tonight. I uh, just want to make sure loops run in. I don't want to have to top it off and all this other stuff after I get it closed up. We're about done with this thing. I'm thinking of making a little trim piece here with cutouts for the hard drives and I can do that while the loop's running in. And I'm not real crazy about this. I mean this isn't terrible but I just don't see any reason to advertise for tough power power supplies. I mean they didn't give it to me for free or something. So I'm thinking of putting a uh, little trim piece there. Are you listening Thermal Tank? Give me free power supplies. I won't cover it up with trim plates next time. Anyway, it's a nice uh, nice rig. It's a 780i motherboard with a uh, 8800 GTX. It's been liquid cool with a blast flow full coverage water block and uh, got a 4 gigs of RAM in there, which is all you really need for this kind of rig. You could put a couple more cards in there if you wanted to, but he's happy with one card. You've got uh, 140 millimeter fans up top, 140 millimeter fan on the middle rad, and then everything else is S Flex 1900 RPM fans, which I found to be about the quietest, nicest fans to run on a radiator. But, uh, you know, it looks like it's a uh, Doing pretty good. I'm not seeing a whole lot of air in the loop. I mean, there's some bubbles. But, uh, and I etched the reservoir just for some artistic effect, which will show up a lot better with light, let me tell you. But we're going to work on that. I got these clear caps that uh, accept an LED, so I'm thinking that'll light up those nice, and I'll just fish the wires in. I want to make it easy to uh, service so everything is right out in the open for him. It's not hard to pull the card in and out, do things like that. And you can pull the hard drives in and out really fast, you know. It's a nice rig. Took me long enough, but uh, I've had a very patient client and I'm very happy to get to this point. Let me